it's Justine and today we have the iPhone MagSafe battery charger. I'm actually very excited to test this out. I've seen a bunch of people talking about this. Yes, there are tons of battery chargers and battery packs out there, but this one obviously works with the Apple ecosystem. So you'll be able to tell in the control center what the battery life is on it. I'm mostly excited about this for my iPhone mini because this battery obviously does not last as long as the iPhone Pro Max. I mean, this battery, honestly, I don't ever even really need to charge it until it's time for bed. So I feel like this is kind of one of those emergency situations to kind of always have it with me or to charge my mini. Oh, look at you, here it is. Do we have any instructions in here? Anything that may be some fine reading material that I may be interested in? No. So here it is, and to charge this device, you actually do need to have a lightning cable, which is not included in the box. I do wish that you were able to charge this wirelessly because I really only use wireless chargers now. The MagSafe Duo is pretty much my go-to, but I guess I could use that charging cable with the MagSafe Duo, plug this in, and then when I actually need to charge my phone, I can switch it over. But now, it's time to test it out. Ready? sticks itself right to the back of the phone because it's a magnet. I love MagSafe so much. So this is what it looks like on the Pro Max. I mean, it's on there. Like, look, I'm wiggling. I'm actually trying as hard as I can to get it to come off, and it is not. This is on there. Now this is what it looks like on the mini phone. It's actually a perfect fit. This looks so good on the white. So this kind of feels a little bit like the silicone cases. It does have more of kind of like a plasticky texture. It doesn't feel as silicone-ish, but it does have a very nice smooth finish. Of course, it has the MagSafe charging logo right there. Here's what it looks like in a lineup between the Pro Max and the Mini. It's like a little baby. And this is another one of the MagSafe chargers. So this is kind of like the little wired version. And you know, you just, Go like that. <laughs> That's it. I'm loving all of the MagSafe accessories. There's so many really great ones. So it doesn't look like this is charged. So to charge it, we just plug in our lightning. You can see we have a little light notification there to let you know that it's charging. Now I'm curious, can I charge this and charge my phone at the same time? and it looks like you can, which is very, very exciting. This is actually kind of cool because I can not only charge the battery pack, but I can also charge my phone at the same time. So this is one of my favorite features. So you can tell the battery life of your devices that are connected. So my Apple Watch fully charged. My iPhone is about 50%. And if I attach my battery pack, we can see that it is about one fourth charged. So I'm gonna need to plug that thing in and get it charging. So you'll see the widget change when I plug it in. And now, you can see that it's charging. Since this is uh, basically the first five minutes that I've used it, I think my initial impressions are I really do like the way that it's designed. There are a ton of third-party accessories, obviously, to charge your phones, but if you have an iPhone Pro Max, your battery should definitely last you throughout the day. So some days when I do get up at 5 a.m. and I'm using my phone pretty much nonstop throughout the day, there are times that I do want to get a little bit of a charge, and if I am driving, my phone is plugged in. So most of the time, I never really feel worried or panicked that my phone is gonna die. And like I said, for the iPhone mini, because the battery life on this isn't as good as the Max versions, this is such a great accessory, I think, for people who do have the smaller phone and just wanna make their smaller phone a little bit bigger. <laughs> so this is Apple's MagSafe Duo Charger. I've showed you guys this before, but it honestly is really like one of my favorite things. I love that it does have the built-in Apple Watch charger. And of course, you have your MagSafe wireless charging over here. And now this is kind of all of Apple's charging accessories that they currently have out. You've got your regular MagSafe, you've got your MagSafe Duo, and our new battery pack. Look at this top down, hello, you look great. So on the Apple website, it doesn't really say the size of the battery, but Mac Rumors is saying that this has a 1,460 milliamp hour battery, which should roughly give you one full charge for the 12 mini and a partial charge for the rest of the 12 Pro models. This is cool because you can obviously use this for anything else that's Qi wireless compatible, like your AirPods or an Android phone, which is pretty cool. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. This was just a quick little look at the new MagSafe battery pack that Apple just released. I have only been using it for basically the amount of time that you've been watching me film this video. But like I said, my iPhone 12 Pro Max, the battery life is so good that I never really have that need 
to charge it. But this is gonna be great just to kind of have with me on the go, just as that extra added security. Like what if I need to charge my AirPods? What if I need to charge my iPhone because I've been up since 3 a.m., which sometimes happens. I don't enjoy waking up that early, but sometimes you have to do what you have to do. If there's anything else you guys would like to see me make videos of, please leave it in the comments below and I'd love to hear what you guys think of the MagSafe battery pack. Also, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you'll be notified when I post new videos. It's almost tech season, so you better believe that we're gonna be ramping up the video production here very, very soon. So until then, I'll see you guys in the next one.